So it's been a while since last time we've spoken about getting your account back because it's been suspended. As all of you know, if you come to my account standing, you will find the statue of your account. So if it's very limited or at risk, you're not banned yet because it will be temporary. And then when it's regulated, your account will become normal. But once it's suspended, it's forever. And here I'm going to show you what you can do about it. Because if you've been banned or suspended on Discord because of some reasons that are weird, like spamming or age verification, age requirement, they will tell you minus 13 years old or something like this then you can get your account back but if you've been banned because you broke some of discord terms of service or community guidelines such as bullying people or intentionally spamming or self botting your account then here i don't think there is a solution there is no clear solution to fix this but in general if you want to try to contact discord um, this is what you can do it's actually opening this website you will find it down below i'm just gonna explain how to fill this okay so if you've been banned you just come to appeals and a update requests okay so after you select this one you write your email address and then how can we help you will just select update my age information if you've been banned for age information and then an action uh, taken on my account or bot and then what would you like to appeal an action take on my account and then you're gonna write something here and then description and then you'll continue speaking with discord outside of this but if you want to actually update your age information you will just write your date of birth here the month the day and the year and then after that you have the description you're just gonna to send them stuff as you can see you gotta send them a, a photo of yourself in the photo you must be holding a photo id and which shows date of birth and a piece of paper with your discord username this is what you have to do actually i explained this a lot of times so uh, the only thing why i'm remaking this video it is because some people ask me how long are they gonna take so there is no official information from discord but what i can you but what i can tell you is that discord for now at least are taking weeks or even months to reply to people so what i suggest you to do is that just come here to sign in and then log in with your email if it's your first time in this website you just click on get a password and then you type here the email that you use to send a request to discord and then you will and then you will enter to the website you just come here click on your photo just a second let me move this you click on the photo hello yo bro what's up there is something wrong with this website there is something wrong yeah there is something wrong with my browser i suppose but in general you come to this website slash requests and you will find all of your requests here it doesn't work for me but if it works for you once you click here you will get how to access the requests but in general these are the requests i've sent to discord you need to find it still open if you find it solved then discord reply to you if you find it closed then you'll have to just come here and send something like a reply create a follow-up or reply here and then it will become open again and do not give up until your account is back or the statue is solved you know uh, yeah this was the video i hope it helped you it's the same thing i've done but and i just got this thing watch out for stolen accounts and expected acts with the usual with an usual urgency maybe a sign of a stolen account stay vigilant let's click on more tips and see what they say so they say keep an eye out for common scams and the scams that happen a lot in discord so they say i reported you by accidents scammers will try to scare you into messaging a fake discord and employee to report that someone reported you false and stuff by accident and stuff just in order to steal your account they'll probably ask you for email password and 2fa and stuff like that the second one is temporarily change your email to validate or unban your account i say do not change your email on your account because discord will never ask you to do this and this is one of the hacks that have been circulating for a long time and it happened even to me before they say try my game oh i'm a developer i don't have friends i don't have anybody i want you to try my game and they will send you files and yeah you will go away let's learn more about some scams um okay so it opened this um i think i will leave you um some of this i think i will leave you this website down below and i hope you read this so you avoid getting scammed or getting your account stolen